I think we are all set to get started. Thank you for coming out for our eighth grade chorus, high school chorus, and sixth grade band concert on the second of two rainy days. But I hope that the music that we share with you tonight can brighten your day. Uh, on first program, we have the Frederick W. Harden eighth grade chorus under the direction of Mrs. Paul Ryan. Thank you very much and welcome. Um, I'd like to introduce the chorus and our first number this evening is Mr. Santa. Thank you. looks like. <laughs> I keep telling them all week. Everybody has a fan. I keep telling them all week to try and smile when they're out there and not look like they're going to barf. I think they got it. It, it always amazes me every year when they walk in to my class in the beginning of September, they don't even want to sing. They look at me like, what are you, crazy? You're going to make me what? You're going to make me sing? And they look at their feet, and they don't really make any sound, and they, it was like, like a mind co contest. It's really, no one's doing anything. And then by December, they sound like this, which I think is pretty darn good if you, if you ask me. It takes a lot of courage to be in eighth grade, and it takes a real lot of courage to, to be in eighth grade and get up here and sing. So you guys, no matter what you do, you should be really proud of yourself. And on that side of mind, our next song for this evening is Santa Claus is Coming to Town. Hope you enjoy it. Thank you. 
like Mr. Schaefer. Uh, next, we are going to be singing Ode to Peace, which is based on a Beethoven's Ninth Symphony Chorale and Schiller's old On Die for a Day. Thank you. for this evening is Jacob Bell's Rock. Thank you.
thank you very much. And I have to give them credit, well, for a lot of things, because they are wonderful. Um, but I have to say that all of their little movements that they did on the last song was all their own chore 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 choreography. Choreography. Yeah. Choreography? I don't know. I'm a music teacher, not a dance teacher. So they did all of that themselves. They, you know, over the course of a couple of months while I was playing my piano, they started moving. They were sneaking it in there, and then all of a sudden I was like, hey, that looks pretty good. Let's do it. So they, they dance and sing, and they do a pretty, pretty fantastic job. So thank you all for being a kind audience. Um, next, we're going to have the high school chorus with Mr. Todd Schaefer, the wonderful Mr. Todd Schaefer. So please don't go anywhere, and they will be right out. Thank you very much. Have a Merry Christmas. Up next, we have the Blackstone Mill Original High School Chorus. We're going to be performing five selections for you. If you noticed, I, I pushed the piano away. Um, it's not because all of our songs are acapella, it's because I am the worst piano player in the school. Um, so I have employed the help of Mr. Oliver Ryan to uh, run my other piano player um, to accompany us. Our first song is called Down by the Riverside.
all fared you well. They wanted to do it at the end of the concert, it fared you well, but it sounds better right <laughs> Bye. 
Alright, it's called Somewhere in My Memory. Administration, Mr. Dudak, Dr. Thompson, the support that we get in this school, in this program, is what keeps us alive, is what keeps us making music like this. So if we can give a round of applause, thank you for coming out. And just so I can uh, smile tomorrow, I, don't they look incredible in these, in these uniforms? change as we bring the sixth grade band out. Thank you for coming out. <laughs> On stage now, we have the Frederick W. Hartnett sixth grade band under the direction of Mickey Ireland.
uh, thank you so much. We're so glad uh, all of you made it out to the performance tonight. Uh, my name is Mickey Ireland. I'm the Woodman Specialist for actually grades 5 through 12 here uh, at BMR, but primarily I'm a 5th grade and 6th grade guy. Um, and this is our first performance of the 2014-2015 season. And one thing that we love about the 6th grade is these kids are making the transition from playing in band once to twice per week to having band every single day. And the strides that they get to make on their instruments, it's a real pleasure for Mr. Martins and I to get to teach them. Um, for instance, this first piece, the piece they opened with, it alternated between sections of music in 4-4 four, four time and 3-4 time. Some of the time they get to count 1, 2, 3, 4. Some of the time they get to count 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. And from the first day that we worked on this, they didn't miss a beat. Last year, all their songs, four beats at a time, four beats at a time. So that's just a taste of the strides that they have made. One of the other things that's special about sixth grade is we give the ch kids a chance to move up to what we call specialty instruments. So there are a number of children on the stage who are playing a brand new instrument that they've only been playing for two to two and a half months. And I'm just thrilled with the strides that they have made on those specialty instruments. It's quite the challenge. Um, our next piece is a big change of pace. It's by composer John Edmondson, and it's entitled Aztec Sunrise. Uh, and the name kind of says it all. Think of off in the American Southwest, early in the morning, red and orange colored hills and mountains. Uh, we hope you enjoy it. This is Aztec Sunrise. This next piece couldn't be any more of a contrast from the placid style uh, that you just heard. The, for those of you who speak Spanish, you recognize that the next title of the program is entitled Plaza de Toros, which basically translates to bullfighting ring. So think of the, the uh, old bullfights of Mexico and Spain 
and all the pageantry, pageantry that goes along with it, roaring crowd, uh, Toreadors, bulls, uh, and we just hope you soak it up and enjoy Plaza de Toros. Uh, selection on the program, there's definitely uh, a number of people that I absolutely have to thank. Um, first off, I'd like to thank our superintendent of schools, uh, Mr. Alan Himmelberger, and our assistant uh, superintendent of schools, Dr. David Thompson. Uh, if they are in the audience, which they might be, but regardless, please give them a hand because they're fantastically supportive. And also, I'd strongly like to thank uh, the principal at the Hartnett Middle School, uh, Mr. Justin Cameron, and the assistant principal uh, at the middle school, Dr. Janice Laporte. We are so fortunate for the support that they give our music program, and we are really, really lucky to have band every single day. These kids get band five days a week for about 45, 48 minutes, and that is kind of unheard of in many other districts. And we are very, very thankful for that level of support. So please give them a hand. And also, I'd like to thank our director of music, uh, Mr. Todd Schaefer. He's been uh, an incredible mentor to me, and uh, he's, he's a great leader, and I think he's, a, he's the future of this program, and we're so thrilled to have him as our music director. Uh, and I'd also like to thank Mr. Kevin Martins. Uh, he and I work side by side uh, at the middle school, and even though I'm the guy up dancing around waving the stick, Mr. Martins has done almost as much teaching with these students as I have because he's our brass and percussion specialist. So a lot of the times he'll take out the trumpets for a trumpet sectional rehearsal, or he'll take out the trombones for a trombone sectional rehearsal. And conversely, I'll take out the clarinets one period, I'll take out the flutes one period, and he'll go in and cover, cover the rehearsal with the students. So I can't thank uh, Mr. Martins enough for all the, all the great teaching he has done over at the middle school. So, Give uh, Mr. Schaefer and Mr. Martins a round of applause. Our last piece of music, while not being a traditional Christmas song, you know, that we might have grown up with, uh, it's definitely becoming a classic in this modern day and age. It's entitled Believe, and it's from that great movie entitled The Polar Express, which, gosh, came out about 10 years ago. 
Um, and the, the lyrics to the song just really are special, and the song really encapsulates the spirit of the holidays and the spirit of Christmas. And so with that, we thank you so much for attending. Uh, we hope you enjoy this last selection, Believe, from the Polar Express. Thank you so much for coming with a great holiday season.